the Fenway Institute, our kind of founding is out of the HIV epidemic and we've continued to lead, I would say, a lot of domestic trials in HIV research for several years now. Most of our work focuses on HIV prevention, although over the years we've done several HIV treatment trials as well. We have kind of three corners to our mission. We do clinical research, we do education, where we're educating providers on providing really great transgender care, good quality HIV prevention care, and then we also do policy work here. Our policy experts are looking at LGBT policy across the world. It draws a very mission-driven staff, so you're gonna find other people that you have a lot in common with and that are using their time and their expertise and their energy for the same causes that you might be interested in. I'm HIV positive. Fenway Healthy was just one of those places where, um, where I got my health care for the very first time when I moved here in Boston, um, which it was like not two years after I got diagnosed. I didn't know that I was going to be employed by this organization. So when, for some reason, the opportunity came up, it was almost like a dream come true. What we're doing here is impactful and I hear a lot of people that um, I work with and have worked with now like come to Fenway more consistently because of our community outreach. I can really see how this Fenway community is changing the communities around uh, this, this building. So one of my favorite parts of my job is conducting study visits and that's because I get to interact with um, the real people that hopefully this research will influence. I started helping the LGBT community while volunteering during college. And I always heard about Fenway Health all the time. And you know how it's a great place to work at. And it wasn't until I actually started working here and I started developing this passion of helping people out. Making that difference definitely makes me want to come and work every day. And why I want to pursue a degree in nursing now Fenway also is a great place for young professionals to land because they encourage you to go back to school, they encourage you to push yourself to do things that are sometimes outside your job description if um, they're interesting and kind of thrilling to you and I know that that's a big advantage, it's not always available in a lot of work environments. We all come from different backgrounds, some in public health, some in medical, some in business, such as myself, but the one commonality that we actually had is helping underserved communities. I know that the work that I'm doing um, will affect not only my community, but communities everywhere. I look forward to coming to work in the morning because of the passionate people that I work with, many of whom have been here for a really long time and are committed to um, seeing the end of the HIV epidemic someday. I feel very happy to be part of an organization that he has um, giving me the opportunity to realize how important it is my contribution and knowing that what I'm doing is going to have a positive impact in the world as a whole. I couldn't do better. I mean, I would just tell everyone, just come here and come and work with us because we need you.